This is a learning and exam preparation video for the IB business syllabus. At the end of the video are practice assignments for you to prepare you from the exams. Please click www.intmace.com on the link at the bottom of this video to do the assignments for this topic. Unit 1.6 Growth and Evolution 2 Internal and External Growth the difference between internal and external growth. Businesses with growth as a strategy have two broad options to choose from. 1. Internal, organic, growth. 2. External, fast track, growth, internal growth. It occurs slowly and steadily and takes a long time. It occurs out of the existing operations of the business firm grows without taking many risks. It expands by developing product ranges. Expansion from internal growth is self-financed using retained profits. External growth. Quick and risky a method of growth. The business expands by entering into some type of arrangement to work with another business. Needs significant external financing. External growth methods. There are many ways of expanding externally like 1. Merger and acquisitions 2. Joint venture 3. Strategic alliances 4. Franchises 1. Mergers and acquisitions Merger occurs when two business become integrated by joining together to form bigger combined business. Acquisition occurs when by one business taking over the other, mergers and acquisition can integrate businesses in four ways. 1. Horizontal Integration When two businesses integrated in the same industry and in the same line of business. 2. Backward Vertical Integration When one business integrates with another business further back, at an earlier stage, in the chain of production. 3. Forward Vertical Integration When one business integrates further forward, to a later stage, in the chain of production. It occurs when a business wants to secure outlet for its products. 4. Conglomeration or Diversification When two businesses in unrelated lines of business integrate, it occurs to reduce overall corporate risk and to have complementary seasonal activity, mergers and acquisition. Advantages of M&A 1. Economies of scale 2. Complementary activities 3. Control up the chain of production Disadvantages of M&A 1. Costly 2. High legal and consulting fees 3. If the takeover is hostile, a culture clash occurs. 4. Employees from the two companies do not work well together. 2. Joint ventures. When two businesses agree to combine resources for a specific goal and over a finite period of time, a separate business is created. At the expiry of date, the new business is either dissolved or incorporated into another business. This transfer of skills, knowledge, and expertise, joint ventures. Advantages of joint venture. Both enjoys greater sales. Joint venture can bring different areas of expertise. It creates a powerful combination. Disadvantages of joint ventures. Do not produce the desired outcome. Disagreement between partners will occur. Effectiveness of the partnership is compromised and the partnership, or joint venture, breaks apart. 3. Strategic alliances. Strategic alliances are similar to joint ventures because both are collaborating for a specified goal. However, strategic alliances differ from joint ventures in several ways. More than two businesses may be part of the alliance. No new business is created. Individual businesses in the alliance remain independent. Strategic alliances are more fluid than joint ventures. Strategic alliances. 
all of these strengths are also weaknesses. The more challenging coordination and agreement. Alliance has less force than a legally extant enterprise. Individual businesses may gain benefit from the alliance. Remaining independent do not get the capital strength nor do they enjoy economies of scale. Greater fluidity of members also means that the alliance lacks stability. 4. Franchising. Popular for businesses that want to expand globally. Franchising involves the following. Franchiser. An original business, known as the franchiser. The franchiser has a host or home country. The franchiser can then sell to other businesses in the other places where it wants to expand. Franchisee. Businesses, known as the franchisees, buy the right to offer the concept and sell the product. Franchisees can be individuals, partnerships, or companies. Have the knowledge of local markets, conditions, and cultures. Examples of franchises McDonald's, fast food, budget, car hire, Hilton, hotels, cost of franchise. The franchisee must pay for the franchise itself. Pay in form of royalty. Both have specific responsibilities according to the business. Division of responsibilities in a franchising. The franchiser will provide the stock, the fittings, the uniforms, staff training, legal and financial help, global advertising, global promotions, division of responsibilities in a franchising. The franchisee will employ staff, set prices. Set wages. Pay an agreed royalty on sales. Create local promotions. Sell only the products of the franchiser. Advertise locally. Which party provides the outlet and which party provides the startup costs can vary considerably according to the strength of the brand. Advantages for the franchisee. 1. The product exists and is usually well known. 2. The format for selling the product is established. 3. The setup costs are reduced. 4. The franchisee has a secure has no control over what to sell supply of stock. 5. The franchiser can provide legal, financial, managerial, and technical help. Disadvantages for the franchisee. A franchisee. 1 has unlimited liability for the franchise. 2. Has to pay royalties to the franchiser. 3. Has no control over what to sell. 4. Has no control over supplies. 5. Makes all the global decisions, advantages for the franchiser. Gains quick access to wider markets. Makes use of local knowledge and expertise. Does not assume the risks and liability of running the franchise. Gains more profits and the sign-up fees. Disadvantages for the franchiser. Loses some control in the day markets today running of the business. Can see its image suffer if a franchise fails. Practice assignments, exam prep assignments for the IB business studies syllabus. You may now proceed to try out the exam preparation assignments. All assignments will be marked and feedback will be given. Should you need to speak to one of our tutors send your email to administration at intmace.com. Please proceed to the link www.intmace.com at the bottom of this video to commence with your practice.